correct measurement of length, motion and measurement of distance. Today we will learn how to do correct measurement of length. In our daily life, we use various type of measuring device as shown in figure. We use a meter scale for measuring length. A tailor use a tape, whereas a slot merchant uses a meter rod. We cannot measure the girth of a tree using a meter scale. Measuring tape is more suitable for this. In taking measurement of length of an object, suitable device must be chosen. For taking measurement of length, we need to take care of following. Place the scale in contact with the object along its length as shown in figure A. A correct method. Figure B is incorrect method. In some scales, the end may be broken. You may not be able to see the zero mark clearly as shown in figure. In such cases, you should avoid taking measurement from the zero mark of the scale. You can use any full mark of scale, say 1.0 cm as shown in figure. Then you must subtract the reading of this mark from the reading at the other end. For example, in figure, the reading at one end is 1.0 cm and at the other end it is 14.3 cm. Therefore, the length of the object is 14.3 minus 1.0 cm is equal to 13.3 cm. Correct position of eye is also important for taking measurement. Your eye must be exactly in front of the point where the measurement is to be taken as shown in figure. Position B is the correct position of eye. Note that the, from position B, the reading is 7.5 cm. From position A and C, the reading may be different. Thanks for watching. Keep learning.